Hello guys. Hello guys. Um, it's official. UFC 249 has been cancelled. Wow. This is very disappointing. Um, so many people have been expecting this fight. We're expecting that come 18th April, we'll have um, the headlines between Tony Ferguson and Justin Gage. It's very disappointing to say the least. But uh, in my last video, you would have seen that I mentioned uh, that it's possible given this the dynamic of our time today that Dana White might be violating uh, rules if he decides to go ahead to organize this event. It turns out that the folks at ESPN, the highest uh, levels of uh, authority over there, had to call Dana White to ask him to stand down. That was his exact words, uh, that the event could not hold. You know, it, has, it would have been very, very surprising that given what's going on currently, the COVID situation, people trying to um, follow the social distancing uh, directive in order to curb the spread of this virus, that um, Dana White and the UFC team would go ahead and organize this fight. So it's a logical thing to do. However, Dana White assured that um, the island the one he mentioned recently is still there, that uh, facilities are under uh, construction, that um, fights are definitely going to take place on that island. Then he also thanked the, um, the Indian Reserve area. Um, he thanked them for their support, how they stood by him, that he would definitely organize um, a UFC event in that area, precisely in California. You know, so all or all, all other UFC events have been postponed, put on hold until the situation clears up with uh, COVID nineteen. I believe it's for the best. Uh, it's for the best. You know, given the situation we're facing, there's no need for any rush. We don't have to put anybody at risk. Um, Hopefully, things will normalize once everybody um, is certain that the coronavirus is um, no more spreading. Thank you. Leave your comment.